Oh, hey there. We were just discussing how frustrating it can be when your Gmod runs like this. Right in the middle of an intense gaming session. I feel your pain, but don't worry. I've got the perfect solution for you. In today's video, we're going to tackle the common issue of low FPS in Gmod. Do you want to transform your gaming experience from the sluggishness to a buttery smooth performance like this? Of course you do. So without further ado, let's dive into the steps that will help you increase your FPS by up to two times depending on your computer's capabilities. The first crucial step is to enable the Time64 Chromium branch of Gmod. By doing this, we'll optimize the game to take full advantage of your system's resources. Step one, launch Steam and go to your game library. Find Gary's Mod in your library, right click on it and select properties from the drop down menu. In the properties window, navigate to the betas tab. At the top, you'll see a line that says beta participation and then a drop down box to the right. Yours by default will say none. Just go ahead and click on none and click on times 86 64 chromium plus 64 bit binaries. Steam will automatically start updating Gmod to the Time64 Chromium branch. Once it's done, you're all set. Now we're going to dive into the audioexec.cfg file where we can fine tune Gmod settings to make your FPS soar. First, locate your Gmod installation folder. The default path is usually C, Program Files, Times86, Steam, Steam Apps, Common, Gary's Mod, Gary's Mod, CFG. Look for the audioexec.cfg file and open it in the text editor like Notepad. Inside the auto.exe file, at the top of the line, we're going to enter FPS underscore max and the value of your monitor's refresh rate. For example, my main monitor that I game on is 240 hertz, so I'm going to set mine to FPS underscore max space 240. Save the changes you've made to the auto.exe file and close the text editor. Awesome work, you successfully tweaked the auto.exec.cfg file to optimize Gmod for your specific setup. Now we're going to optimize how Gmod launches. These launch options will allow you to customize how the game starts up and give you more control over over its performance. Open your Steam library and find Gary's Mod in the list. Right click on Gary's Mod from the drop down menu and select properties. In the left hand side in the properties menu, you'll see a general tab. Inside the general tab, you'll scroll down and you'll see launch options and down below a empty bar. This is the bar that you'd want to enter the information that I have set in the description below. On screen now is a little list I put together of what each step in this launch option does and its purpose. Once you're done with this, you can just go ahead and click the close button on Gmod. And if Gmod is open, make sure to close Gmod and relaunch Gmod. And those launch options will now take effect. All right, now you've armed yourself with the knowledge to boost your Gmod FPS significantly. It's time to take your gaming performance to the next level. If you found this video helpful and want to see more content like this, be sure to hit the subscribe button. And hey, if you have any questions or other helpful tips, share them in the comments below. I'd love to hear from you. Until next time, happy gaming and take care.